it's a good thing I'm not monetized because uh, that music is keeping my child asleep. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know, my name is Permage. I'm an artist, writer, gamer, and new mom who likes to make YouTube videos. And today I have a package to open. I'm super excited about this. Um, I'm friends with someone on Twitter who makes masks and other textile things and also is a writer. And recently she and I were chit chatting because she had posted about making hair scrunchies and I was super excited because all of the patterns she had on the table, I was like, I totally want one of those. So I had asked her about it and she was like, well, yeah, they're for sale on my Etsy shop. Here's the link. Um, so yeah, I will have her Twitter handle right here. Uh, and her name is Kate. And I'm going to open this package and show off my scrunchies. I'm going to try and do it without ripping this sticker because this sticker is an astronaut riding a swing that is the moon. And it's super cool. And if I can peel it off of here and stick it on something else, I'm going to do it. All right. Let's see if I can open this without waking my baby. Wish me luck. So far. So she packages her orders in this cute little uh, pouch with tissue paper. My brain just died a little bit. I don't know if you saw that happen. Oh, side note, I'm very excited. My favorite pants, my uh, galaxy jeans, actually fit again. So pumped. So pumped. But that's totally besides the point. I apologize. How do I open this? Oh, I got it. Now, she did mention that if I ordered to let her know and she would throw in some extra goodies. So I'm expecting five scrunchies and then I'll see what else. They look so good. I'm so excited. <gasps> One, two, three, four, five, six. I have seven scrunchies and some stickers. I'm extra excited. Oh, thank you so much for your order and for being an awesome Twitter friend. I hope you love your scrunchies and the bonus ones I added. Thank you for supporting my small business. I like that a lot. That's a nice touch. I might steal this, Kate, like this idea, because that's me likey, me likey. Yeah, and I got stickers. I'm gonna show you the stickers first. So I have a Nemo. I have a super awesome space themed one with a rocket, a moon, and a little astronaut saying hello. That's definitely going on my laptop. Oh, orange oh, kitty cat. I didn't wear my cat ears today. There we go. And, ooh, this one's really cool. So it's like a Day of the Dead decorated camera that says beautiful. That's probably gonna go on my laptop too. Sweet. Yay, stickers. All right, so first I'm gonna show you guys the ones I was expecting and then I'll show you the bonus ones. So I have a mask with the same fabric but when I saw the scrunchie, I was like, oh, that's awesome. So it's Maleficent from the animated um, Sleeping Beauty, <laughs> um, which Sleeping Beauty was one of my favorite Disney princess movies growing up, not because of the princess. I actually don't really care for the story of Sleeping Beauty all that much, but Maleficent was my favorite Disney villain because she was the only one to me that felt like really, really evil. Like pretty much all of the other ones, it was kind of like, they weren't relatable because obviously they're bad guys, but like she was just like scary. So she was always my favorite villain. And so again, these are handmade scrunchies and this feels really, really sturdy. Like this is nice. You likey. How am I gonna choose which one to wear? 
the next one I knew I was getting is this one with an all over pattern of Stormtroopers from Star Wars. So that's cool because I have Star Wars shirts and stuff and I like my space stuff. So fits into my aesthetic perfectly. Then this was one I was really excited about. Um, I had asked specifically about because I didn't realize that they came in packs. I thought I had to buy one. Uh, but this one has game controllers all over it. So this will be uh, probably dawned in my next gaming playthrough vlog when I can actually make that. I'm still trying to figure out the semantics and like, not semantics, the logistics of doing that with a baby because it's like a big process to shoot a game playthrough actually. So I have to do it when she's calm or asleep, which you never know when that's gonna happen. This was actually an impromptu video. I don't have the ears because I wasn't expecting to shoot just now, but then she fell asleep. So I was like, let me get this done. Then there's another Star Wars one that I knew about which is black and just has the Star Wars like logo on it, but it's like falling apart. As if the Death Star just shot the Star Wars logo and it's disintegrating. And the last one that I knew about, which is probably the one I'm gonna wear considering my pants, uh, which I was also really excited about, is this galaxy print one. And I didn't realize from her Twitter post, but there's actually like glitter in this. So it's shiny. I'm excited and then I'm extra excited because I have two bonus scrunchies that I didn't know about so I have this super cute it's another galaxy like space themed one that's got stars and planets and actual Milky Way galaxies on it and this one also oh and Saturn Saturn also has some glitter in it in uh, some of the planets and the galaxies and stuff I don't know if you can see it so take my word for it it's shiny And then last, but certainly not least, least, list. last, but certainly not least, there's this Sailor Jerry style like tattoo one with, um, I think they're supposed to be robins in this style and like yellow roses and the pinup girl. And I think that's it, I think that's it. Yeah, and the anchors. So that one's pretty neat too, because I like tattoos and the Sailor, I would never get a Sailor Jerry style tattoo, but I like to look at them. I think they're really neat, especially when you see like the collections at the tattoo shop, super cool. So yeah, these are my scrunchies that I got from someone that I sort of kind of know via Twitter. Uh, her name is Kate again, as I mentioned, and I will have her social linked below in the description as well as, as I mentioned, I had her handle earlier in the video. Uh, and yeah, she handmade these, which is super impressive. I have no idea how one even does that. I'm not much of a sewer myself. I think it's super cool. Um, I'm, and I mentioned, I'm pretty sure she makes masks as well. So if you're looking for super cool handmade masks, you should check her out because you know supporting small businesses is a big deal and you should definitely do it especially now because a lot of us are uh, riding the struggle bus with this whole covid thing so are you awake look at that timing what do you think you like mommy's new scrunchie she doesn't care she's like i just want the boob mom do you need a diaper change first so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to support Kate and her work via Twitter and her Etsy shop. And don't forget to like and share this video if you enjoyed it. Sharing really helps me reach a broader audience than I could on my own. And comment which scrunchie is your favorite, but let's be honest, they're all fantastic. I don't think I have a favorite. I don't know if I can pick. I don't know if I can pick.
Thank you for watching my video through to the end. And if you are new here, please consider subscribing. I attempt to make three videos a week on this channel, although with a new baby, it's usually more like two. Uh, but I make videos on topics ranging from art to lifestyle to gaming to nerd stuff to mommy vlogs. So I have lots to offer and I think I'm a fun time. And uh, without further ado, I'm going to end this video and give this one some food and I will see you on the next video. Bye!